What's up, folks? I'm standing here with my man, Drake Heightfield. Man, the fight didn't go your way, but as I was researching you for this, you've had a lot of fights. You fought in multiple combat sports. Mm -hmm. Tell me, this is your second bare knuckle fight. You're one and one now. Okay. What's the difference between the, do uh, you think there's a similarity in bare knuckle than the other combat sports such as Muay Thai or MMA? Um, I mean, obviously it's a combat sport, so it's similar in that aspect, but uh, people don't realize how much quicker your hands are without gloves. And uh, the pain is different. It's not a numbing pain that snaps your neck back. It's a sharp, quick pain. Um, and sometimes it just rattles your brain a little too much and there's nothing you can do about it. Uh, so this was the, your, this is your second bare knuckle fight. The first time you've been in the squared circle, the big stage. Yeah. Did it live up to its name and were you excited? Oh yeah, most definitely, man. I was back there, uh, I got real emotional. I was playing with my team, um, my girlfriend Maddie, my coach Lucas. Come on uh, in the back, come guys. Come on in, guys. In the back so they can see you. So uh, they were here with me and, you know, it didn't go exactly as planned even from the beginning. She wasn't supposed to corner me. Um, my teammate, his car broke down and so he couldn't be here to corner me. So she stepped up and helped me out. Um, she's been a rock for me this whole camp. He's been a great friend and coach. He's about to have his first child um, coming up soon. She could be she could be popping any second. Hopefully not till at least tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, at least two hours. At least two hours. Uh, awesome. But uh, yeah, without them, this night would have been way worse. Uh, they were here for me and I felt great. This atmosphere was amazing. And uh, the crowd was really, really awesome too. So. Nice. Awesome, Drake. What's next? Can we see you come back to BKFC? Oh, most definitely. Awesome. Most definitely. Nate told me if I fought my heart out, I would fight for him again. And after that performance, I mean, we both knocked each other down in the first round. I came back in the second and came at him, and he just caught me. So uh, I hope to be back. Last question I have for you. Is there any possibility we might have a young bare knuckle fighter right here? Probably not. <laughs> she is a scrapper. Don't let her. Don't let her look for you. She's tougher than she looks. Nice. But I, I'll be the one fighting. Hopefully not her. Uh, she's too pretty. That's it. You heard it, folks. Drake Hatfield didn't go his way, but he's one and one, and he's ready to come back and do it again. Thank you, guys.